10 tonight. A man is behind bars accused of murder in Washington state. Authorities say the victim was found with an arrow through his body. Fox 12 So Young Kim joins us live from Clark County with the very latest. So Young. Real Pete, investigators say it started as an argument here on Northeast Petticoat Lane and ended with a man dead in a driveway. I got ready to leave and they had the road blocked off. People who live on Northeast Petticoat Lane near St. John's Road in Clark County say they were surprised to see a homicide investigation unfolding on their block Tuesday. We just kept walking back and forth and taking pictures. It's always been quiet except for, you know, don't have too many drugs. They always want to hang down there. Clark County Sheriff's Office says deputies responded to that neighborhood in Northeast Vancouver just before 7 o'clock in the morning to a report a man had shot another man with a bow and arrow. When deputies arrived, they say they found a man dead in the driveway of a house with an arrow in his chest. Yes. Pretty wild. That's unusual. Yeah, it's usually guns. Investigators say it started as an argument that escalated. A witness told investigators they saw two men fighting in front of a house earlier that morning just after 6 o'clock. Then says as one of the men walked away, the other followed in a car. Authorities say it appears the two men returned near the house, and that's where a man was killed with a bow and arrow. Officials have identified the man allegedly responsible as 46-year-old Richard Vanderhoek. They say he called 911 and referred to the victim as an acquaintance. Vanderhoek was taken to a hospital for minor injuries and was arrested on a murder charge. I've been here since 1977. I've never heard of, yeah, anybody actually being shot with a bow and arrow in Vancouver. The case is still actively under investigation. Live in Clark County, So Young Kim, Fox 12 Oregon.